Lauder and Clinique are here to show us how to get holiday ready um, with amazing skincare and makeup. Um, welcome back, Emily and Eileen. Oh, uh, Dora, thanks so much. We are delighted to be here today. And I'm Eileen Daughter. I'm part of the Estee Lauder education team. And I'm coming to you from Seattle. We would love for you to drop into chat where you're tuning in from. Hi, everyone. My name is Emily again, uh, and I am with Clinique Education, and I'm coming to you today from Washington, D.C., the other side. Yeah, it looks like we're all represented. That's right. Awesome. Well, um, viewers, also let us know where you're watching from, just as Eileen said, and post it in the comments, you know, where you are, how's the weather out there, and of course, any questions that you may have um, regarding any of the items that Eileen and Emily will be sharing with us, and of course, any of your favorites, Estee and Clinique, please let us know. So what do you guys have for us today? Oh my gosh, Dora. Well, the theme of our time together is one for you. That's you. <laughs> One from me and Emily, and then wishes granted from Estee Lauder and Clinique. And so I'm so excited to talk to my friend Emily. It's been a while, and we've got some simple tricks today to get you party ready for this holiday season. Emily, can you believe it? I got to tell you this 50 days of counting down right now today until we get through this holiday season. I, I, <laughs> I, I'm blown away by that number because I have done no shopping yet. Yeah. <laughs> Um, let us know in the chat if you have started your shopping yet. Drop us a red heart if you've started shopping yet. Um, unlike myself, what about you, Eileen? Have you started shopping yet? I definitely can't drop a red heart because <laughs> personally, um, I count on my older daughter um, to get me ready for the season. She's like the early bird shopper in our household. But professionally, I always do my first holiday gift wrap at the Estee Lauder counter, and that kind of sets the mood for me. So. There's hope. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. I know for me, um, I while I haven't actually bought any gifts yet, I do have a couple of things that I know that I'm going to buy. Uh, and I thought we could start with um, some of that because of course uh, I like to give the gift of great skin and there's some really great um, Clinique. And I know you've got some great Estee Lauder products um, that uh, come to mind to help us achieve great skin. So we wanted to start there. So we look nice and festive right now with our backdrops. We're going to drop these backdrops so that we can demonstrate some of these amazing products for you all today so that you will be able to see them uh, live and in action. And so as I stated, I wanted to start with some uh, products that will help us really get this healthy, um, great skin overall. And you can't think of Clinique and great skin without thinking about three-step skincare system. Um, so three-step skincare is really where it all started with Clinique, um, starting with the um, first step really being um, about cleansing the skin. And uh, what makes this cleanser so unique uh, is the way that it's formulated. So it is very low lathering. So you're not going to get this residue behind on the skin. Um, it also is loaded with sucrose. So it's soothing and calming. And I would love to demonstrate this. And I actually have this really fun demo. Um, Eileen, you might remember this from last time where I, I was laughing and saying, do you have tape handy? Um, because if you've got tape, you can follow along too. So we're going to do this demo on the back of my hand here um, and you'll be able to see the purpose of the tape is to be able to see this before and after of the power of three-step skincare um, system. Like all products at Clinique, Three Step is allergy tested and 100% fragrance free. Um, so formulated specifically for um, even the um, the most uh, sensitive of skin. So I'm putting just a little bit of that facial soap on the back of the hand and you'll see I'm spraying just a little bit of water here and you'll see that it foams up nicely, but it's not a really uh, heavy lather here. Um, and that's intentional uh, because the more that it lathers, the more likely it is to leave that residue behind um, and not easily uh, rinse off of the skin. So just with this um, step alone, we have removed that dirt and oil Oil, uh, but we also are leaving that moist, that natural moisture barrier intact um, so that the skin never feels tight or dry from your, your cleanser. The next product um, within the three-step system is my ultimate favorite. And I know Eileen, we talked about this guy last time, the clarifying lotion. Uh, I think you were able to give it a try, right? 
a try. I mean, I think you you got me. You did one for me, Emily, because I added it to my my uh, ritual. And I don't have an exfoliator. And so what I loved about this is glowing skin is a thing. And for this holiday, I'm definitely using clarifying lotion. I'm a number three. I think we talked yeah. about this. Yeah, I'm a three. Yeah, so I'm using two today on the back of my hand. Um, I actually um, use number four. Um, so we we have these in um, five different options depending on your skin type um, and skin condition. Um, but with clarifying lotion, as Eileen said, it is a liquid exfoliator. So using this twice a day just to gently sweep away that top layer of dead skin so that ultimately in one sweep, the skin is smoother, more radiant and less noticeable pores. Uh, and for me, I love the way that it makes my makeup wear um, smoother, longer, all day wear. Um, it enhances that with your foundation as well. So you can start to see um, a little bit more brightness, a little not so bright on this side. Um, but what's really cool is once we add in the dramatically different moisturizing lotion, um, now we're just balancing that oil and water um, back out in the skin. So I'm going to put a little drop of dramatically different on one one side of the tape and then on the other side. Oh, got it a little high there. Um, so you can see on the side that we are not doing the, the um, cleanser and the clarifying lotion on. It actually starts to foam up a little bit like that cleanser did. So you can see it sitting on the surface of the skin versus absorbed right into the surface, or excuse me, right into the skin. And that's really what um, why we do this tape demo here is we're showing, as you can see me nice and clear here, when I put the tape in front, you can see that top layer of dead skin. So the whole purpose of three step skincare is really to um, not only gently cleanse, but exfoliate and hydrate the skin um, all along the way, creating again, healthy skin. So it's a great gift to give to somebody to give them the gift of great skin. And one other product that I wanted to slide in here that I'm excited to give, I have many people, I actually will probably be replenishing this for a lot of my friends and family for the holidays. Uh, and that is our smart clinical repair wrinkle correcting serum. This targets the signs of aging from three different angles. Uh, we're repairing lines and wrinkles with uh, peptides in the formula. We actually are helping to resurface the texture of the skin uh, with advanced retinol in the formula and then replumping uh, with hyaluronic acid. So it's a multitasker here, uh, but again, helping with the de-aging concerns. So those are a couple of things that um, you know, I'm gifting to others but also, of course, I use myself, so I'll probably throw a couple of these extra special holiday gift sets in my bag as well um, to give great skin. Eileen, I know that you have one of my favorite products, an iconic product in the industry that you wanted to highlight too. My gosh. Okay. So first of all, that was an amazing little demo you just did. And when I think about gift giving, I need to think about everyone on my list. And Emily, this little bottle is like beauty sleep in a bottle. So could you imagine you could gift this to anyone? I think we're all feeling like during this holiday time, will we get enough sleep? Probably not. <laughs> I don't know. I, I didn't, I haven't lately. So you know what? This is the secret to waking up with great looking skin that looks refreshed and glowing. And I'm going to put a little, little bit on Emily. You've used it before, huh? Oh, yes. Yes. And what, what's your feedback? Just the instant glow that you get right. um, and comfort to the skin is, is pretty powerful. Right. And look at Dora. I know you're looking at that. Like, look at that beautiful radiance, right? Well, this is seven serums in one. So wow. no matter what, right? So mm -hmm. no matter what you're thinking your skin needs, we got you with advanced night repair. This uh, legendary sleep hero is got a night peptide that actually works at night to activate the skin's natural repair process. But you know what I love? It has hyaluronic acid, which binds moisture, creates that environment for repair. So I'm gonna show you, um, I've already done my skincare, but I'm gonna prep my skin for a holiday look. And I'm gonna use Advanced Night Repair. And what I love, I use a full dropper and this locks in radiance and hydration for up to 72 hours. So let's begin. So I'm gonna use a heart-shaped motion and just kind of refresh my skin. And I love this because it kind of activates, gives a little micro circulation. I always do like a little bit around the mouth because you know I'm going to put a holiday lip on. 
So I'm going to get it right now, but um, it's not easy. And so with Advanced Night Repair, it's really a great gift because it comes in multiple sizes and it really could be for anyone. Anyone who has skin, this is the perfect gift to give. Oh, I know we are talking about one for you, one for me so far. I <laughs> want them all for, for me, but you know, and, and I'll just kind of jump in real quick to remind everybody that of course our military families, um, they get a special uh, pricing at the exchange and all of these items are available. So maybe they can get one for, for themselves and one for, for others, but um, it's always great military exclusive pricing and tax-free. So it adds up to wonderful savings for our servicemen and, and women and their families. So, and all of these products are also on um, shopmyexchange.com. So if you can't go in store, you can can order online. That's making it so easy, Dora. I, I think one for you, one for me, one for Emily. Yes. It's, it's gonna happen. <laughs> um, so as far as prepping the skin, those are just some great tips from Emily and I, and now we'd love to move on to complexion. And I'm going to be using Double Wear. And if you're a Double Wear fan, drop us your shade in the chat. Um, I'm actually going to be using the number one selling foundation in Fresco 2C3. That's my shade. Um, I love this formula, especially for the holidays. I'm going to be using it to give a more full coverage, cashmere matte-like finish. Um, but one of the things you should know about this foundation is it's actually flexible. It's breathable, waterproof, transfer resistant, heat proof, humidity proof, sweat proof. Sounds a little holiday proof right there. And it comes in 56 shades. And so I'm going to be using my go-to shade. Um, it seems like I'm still not transitioning yet. Please don't let it be a lighter shade here in Seattle. We don't get as much sun, um, but I'm trying to maintain my shade. So I'm going to be using, like I said, 2C3, but I'll be bronzing up. And I'm going to use a little bit of double wear, as you can see. And I'm going to use a couple drops of advanced night repair. I'm in actually an oilier skin, but I love this because it actually gives beautiful radiance to the skin. I'm going to mix it on the back of my hand so I have a nice little mixture. And here we go. I'm going to use a kabuki brush and just buff on radiance. And I love this because getting sometimes holiday ready, you don't always have the chance to start fresh face. You got to kind of touch up what you want. So this is my trick for holiday ready um, for a more co full coverage cashmere like feel. And then you can stipple where you want a little more coverage. What do you guys think? That's great. That's great. Well, this we hope is the is the goal here. Um, so like I said, double wear is so easy. Definitely more of a matte finish. On this side, I'm going to be doing something for those no makeup makeup kind of looks, uh, but just looks a little more polished. And this is a brand new makeup. Ellie, I'm very excited to share this with you. This is Futurist. Serum, skin tint serum. Um, it looks so luxe. I love the bottle. It looks like a serum itself, but you actually want to shake it up. It comes in 29 shades and it has this amazing dropper like a serum, but this is a natural skin tint serum. And so it's really amazing because it's so lightweight. I was so impressed, but it gives this natural radiance to the skin. Um, I actually have my same shade here but I've been toying with um, going a little bit lighter and a little bit darker because it's so flexible. Um, so I'm gonna be applying it on this side of my face, but here's what I love about it. It's lightweight, buildable, so you can get the look, even if you want a more flawless look on, on your skin, you can do that. But it's got benefits that help your skin actually look better even when you take it off. So that's a gift right there. And it's 85% skincare benefits in the um, skin tint serum. So I'm going to actually apply it onto my cheek area. I love this though. It actually has um, three, it's a blend of botanical oils and it's wrapped with a soft matte clay. So that's why the, the finish is like super natural, but almost like soft focus. I feel like I'm having a, a trend moment where I could still do cloud skin going into the season. What do you guys think? Yeah, I love how that you got, yeah, the, the skin care and complexion mix, I think is, is amazing. That's one trick that I know I've learned from you two in the past. It's like, oh, I can mix my skin care and my complexion and it's just twice the benefits. I love that. Yeah. And I love, um, like I said, with this one, you can, you can really adjust, like, I'm not going to give up my double wear because I love it so much. So if you are a fan, you're probably thinking, oh, 
I can't wardrobe that for this season. I got to keep that for me. Um, this is a great option that you can use for those no makeup makeup days or even um, to build it up a little bit. So Emily, how about you? Yeah, I know we, we're talking about wardrobing, um, you know, here with foundation. So there's so many options out there, right? And and it depends on the day um, as to which one I pull out of my bag because um, I have lots of different options. So um, another option um, could potentially be our even better clinical um, serum uh, uh, foundation, excuse me, our even better foundation, SPF 15. And if you have any discoloration on your skin, this is a formula uh, that you want to consider adding to your your makeup bag. It actively improves your skin while you wear it, helping to break up um, any clusters of melanin that you might see when you look in the mirror, whether it's from just natural aging or whether it's from acne scars. Um, uh, it works to actively improve those. So when you take the foundation off, you still are left with some of that treatment uh, benefit onto your skin. Um, and you get your SPF 15 in the formula as well. So we're protecting your skin uh, throughout the day. It's a beautiful, um, creamy formula that um, gives a very natural finish. So I'm going to actually apply this. I, I came today, let me take off my glasses so you can see. I mean, you might have noticed with Eileen too, uh, we have one eye done and one eye not done <laughs> um, on purpose. I know you thought, you thought I was winking at you the whole right. time. <laughs> <laughs> but I also just did one side of my face with foundation, um, but I did not do the other side yet purposely so that I could apply my foundation on um, together with you today. Um, so one of my tips, uh, and, and, you know, I do this year round, but I definitely talk to my friends and family about adding this in for the holiday season when we, we want that extra glow, or maybe it's, um, you feel like you're a little bit more dehydrated in the winter months that we're, you know, currently entering and going through. Um, one of my favorite tips is to actually wet my foundation brush brush with a little bit of a lightweight hydrator um, before applying my foundation with that same brush. So the hydrator that, that I use um, from Clinique is our Clinique Moisture Surge 100 hour. So if you've ever, you know, used Clinique or shopped at Clinique before, you probably have tried this guy before. It is um, a top selling moisturizer in the industry. It's an oil-free gel that um, surges the skin with that hydration that it needs to just really feel comfortable. Not only instantly, it boosts 174% um, more hydration instantly, but it will lock that hydration in for up to 100 hours. And I think it's so popular because it's so easy to use and anyone can use it uh, as an oil-free gel, but maximum hydration. So again, I'm going to wet my brush. Um, so I've got a little bit of that on the end of my brush here. And so what I do is just stipple this in to the skin. So this gives me that just that little extra boost of hydration uh, to the skin. And again, now my foundation brush is wet. So now I can go in with this foundation, same brush, um, and get that um, beautiful hydrated look with a little bit of a glow, but also helping, of course, to even out my skin tone um, with the foundation along the way. So one trick you'll see here, I'm using our foundation buff brush here. So I stipple it on, um, but then you're going to just, it's really the, the motion of the wrist here. So we are airbrushing it um, with this brush. Um, and we have another brush that is more of a flat brush. So if you like more of a full coverage, using a flat brush will help you to get that fuller coverage. But I like to let my skin show through a little bit in my look. Um, so we're gonna just airbrush this on. And then you can finish off with a little extra stipple and we're done. What do you think, Eileen? Awesome. I mean, I would have never thought to apply my moisturizer with that a brush like that. So. Yeah, it's a great way to, again, wet that brush so you get a, a nice, healthy glow that comes through. It's, it's a fun little trick, party trick. <laughs> I love your party trick. Well, I got a couple of tricks for you. Yeah. Um, you know, I love a good sun kiss look all year round. And I think bronzer just gives you that healthy glow. So I'm going to be using the Bronze Goddess. Oh, I love this. Um, the shades I love because they never turn orange. And you know what? It gives kind of that soft matte feel. I'm at oilier skin, so it does help control oil. And so I'm going to be using just a little bit. I like a little tighter um, 
softly defined contour. So I'm going to use a blush brush um, and I start in the cheek area and then kind of connect like this three, staying on kind of the high points and then under the jawline. Um, hopefully I'm getting some life back in my skin. Dora, how are you no, feeling I there? That is Thank actually, you. you can see that immediate uh, bronzer. Right? Yeah, yeah, yes, really good demonstration. So, like I said, when I, I, my foundation shade, I like a touch lighter um, and I like to add my color through bronzer. So I'm gonna do the other side again. I usually start in the cheek area and then kind of connect. This is like the easy part. You can't go wrong. And then whatever is left, I'll actually, I have it in the crease of my eye and on top of my eyelid. So I've done a little bit of liner and then just buffed it out with the bronzer. So can you guys see that? Yes. Very pretty. Coming together. Yep. So here's my favorite party trick. This is actually um, something that I do when I don't want to put a lot of color on my cheeks because you know I'm going to bring that bold lip. I'm going to bring my holiday lip here in a minute. But I'm going to take a little bit of advanced night repair. I'm going to take my favorite red lipstick that I'll be wearing later. And I like to take a little bit on my hand. And I feel like this is like the perfect Estee glow moment. You mix them together. I've seen lots of um, custom tinting on the cheeks on social. So um, this is my way of kind of doing it. And I do it a little bit higher is just to give less emphasis on my cheek area. I like it on the, the, the cheekbone here. So it gives like a nice soft look. What do you guys think? Fun. Very, Very pretty. pretty. And our viewers are loving all the tips, the glow, the beautiful glow from Emily and now the the tint and the bronzer from Eileen. We're getting a lot of love for those tips. Sounds That's like fun. everybody's ready for mm -hmm. some makeup this holiday. <laughs> yeah. All these fun tips. So I got that. This is one of my favorite techniques, Emily. So um, That's great. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. So um, one of the other tips that I'll, I'll add in here um, for the holidays, um, eyes are really uh, making a, a statement this holiday season. And you'll see, um, again, um, Eileen and I came with you know, one eye done, one eye not done um, for a purpose because uh, we wanted to show some of our favorite uh, ways to dial up your eyes for the holiday season. So um, I'm going to share a couple of my favorite uh, ways to do that. And then um, Eileen will as well. And the first one I wanted to start with, um, and actually Eileen, I think you have this one too, um, is we're talking about mascara. Um, lashes are really uh, an easy way to dial up your look um, by changing your mascara formula for the holidays. Um, and maybe it's not every day, maybe it's just for that party or event that you have going on. But like for me, um, I, on a everyday basis, I wear Clinique's high impact mascara. This is our number one selling mascara. It's a beautiful, easy application, um, gives a beautiful, um, you know, uh, separation and lift to the lash. But for the holidays, um, I'm dialing it up a little bit with our newest formula. It's our Hi-Fi full volume mascara, uh, because on contact, this will give a 230% more volume than my traditional mascara would. So I get that extra lift. Um, it has um, some conditioning agents in the formula as well. Some There's actually three different oils in the formula. The wavy brush um, that um, it comes with helps me to really separate every lash. So for application, let me just get my self-situated here. Um, for me, what I like to do is to start at the base of the, the lash, and then we're just going to wiggle and pull up. And this brush really helps to separate every single lash and pick up on those lashes. It's an ultra um, pigmented formula as well, as well as the fiber formula. Well, there we go. Now I can see better. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so it separates every single lash. So you can really start yeah. to see them being pulled up here mm -hmm. and that definition starting to happen. So again, for every day, I like my high impact, but for these party moments, I'm going high five. What about you, Eileen? What's your mascara but, choice? I love it. I wish there was one that did it all, but I'm always in the search for another yeah. one. Yeah. <laughs> and I love, um, like, I love our Sumptuous Extreme, kind of like that every day. Like you said, this is like all the pump, no clump. 
this is a great one. And I feel like it's feather light. Like it doesn't weigh my lashes down because I have like 10 lashes. Please say there's other people like me. And so <laughs> I want every single one to show. So as you can see, I have my 10 that I found, but I actually using the new Termo Lash, I, I want to bring a little more drama this season. And so this is a volumizing, dramatic mascara that has oils as well. So I love that. Um, so it really conditions the lashes, but it really volumizes. So when I challenge, you see on one eye, I have it. I'm about to show you how to pump them up and bring the drama. So the brush actually has, it's really unique because it also finds those lashes you didn't know you ha didn't have. <laughs> But I like to stamp it in the lash line so and create some depth. Stamping is a thing these days. So stamping, I learned this from one of our Estee artists. So I too am always trying to find a new lash trend. Um, but I love how one stroke and stamping and then I feather mine through. So coming together, not winking That's at you good. anymore. <laughs> Um, and I love this one too, because you can do a couple extra coats and really get into the base. So that it really gives you that nice lift to the lashes. So another thing I love to do, obviously I love a strong brow and I'm going to play to my lips. So I'd encourage you all maybe just a little more on your brow this season, but I'm going to be using a little bit of shimmer, not sparkle, but shimmer. <laughs> um, and I'm going to use um, just from our traditional palettes. I'm going to actually use my finger. And I'm going to actually press it onto the lid just to show you how that bronzer and it just kind of pops the eyes. But I literally love this because it gives a little bit of shimmer just on that inner corner. And when I don't do it with my finger, I feel like it doesn't turn out the same way. So yeah. <laughs> it's so the, warmth, that... the warmth yeah. of your finger. It gives it uh, something to grab yeah. to there. It's a great tip. My favorite. Yeah. So much control. Yeah, that's good. So well, there we have it. Yeah, it looks good. I was going to just um, add one more thing, if I could, uh, to dial up the eye. One trend that's back right now is actually lining the waterline. Uh, and when I first heard about this, I had flashbacks to high school because, uh, you know, like we would we, we would did actually, it. We would actually light it, right? And make it wetter, but you don't have sure to did. do that today. You don't have to do all that. Uh, we have a new um, eyeliner that actually has been tested for the waterline, um, and it's our Gel Tech eyeliner. Um, it stays on for 12 hours in the waterline um, and 24 hours if you were to apply it anywhere else around. So again, I have that done on the top and the bottom here on the side. You can you know see see the difference there. But um, really, the tip you know just uh, for application within that waterline is just to you know use your pinky here, and, uh, pull it down a little bit, and then you can just sketch it in here. Uh, right into that waterline. And you can see it glides on very, very easily. How long does it wear in the waterline? Have you tested it? Uh, 12 hours is the, the wear there. So Ooh, yeah, I can like that. dialing up the drama, maybe not something you yes. do every day, but a really fun way to bring some power to your eyes um, for the holiday season. I love that. Right. That looks amazing. Thank you. Well, you know what? Um, I'm going to dial up the lips then. It, it's time. <laughs> I love a good holiday red, red. I think it just like brings a little bit of attitude and a little bit of fun. Um, and so I'm going to be using Pure Color Lipstick in LA Noir. I love this shade. This is my favorite red. The good news is, is there's up to 80 shades in this um, particular formula. Um, and there's a matte, there's a cream, um, and there's a shimmer. I'm going to be, I think this is one of the originals. Um, it's more of a kind of cream formula, but I have this great technique because if you're going to wear red, you first bring your confidence. Mm -hmm. It's all about that, but you also want to kind of lock it and load it, right? So I'm going to be using, because I want to plump around my lips and keep that great you know, plumpness going. So I'm going to be using the Perfectionist Wrinkle Concentrate, which could be used in a bunch of different places on the face. I just like it around my lips, maybe a touch under my eyes, like right here. But I'm going to be actually mixing just a touch um, of the Wrinkle Concentrate with my foundation, just a touch of whatever's left, like barely anything. You can see my lip is still on there. <laughs> and I'm going to mix it with my finger and literally just swipe around. And remember, I do a lighter shade. This is just my natural lip shade that I'm doing. But remember, I'm catching up for holiday. 
So my trick is if my foundation was slightly lighter, I just take whatever's left on that bronzer, just bronze it slightly. I'm gonna have it too light. And then next step is I always take the lipstick and just roll it up. All right, here you go, LA Noir, coming in hot. Try not to get it on your teeth. <laughs> Shade is always so pretty on you. Love it. It's like, Beautiful. okay, changes the whole game. Yeah. All right, so get amazing. your lipstick, right? You got your lipstick on. And then last step, I always love this, is just to go back and shape the lips. I'm using Dabor Lip Liner. And it's 24-hour wear. And then I like a good, strong Cupid bow. <laughs> Try saying that while you're putting your lipstick on. And I just do the edges. All right, you got to, you know, you got to bring it. That's <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I love the drama. A little more dramatic with that red. Right. And, you know, we we have people watching from all over, and I think we're all impressed at how you guys put on your eye makeup without having your mouth open <laughs> like we normally do. But our <laughs> mascara, our liner, I can't help it. But we've got people from Missouri, New York, um, Liber you know, Fort Liberty, um, Atlanta. I mean, they're all over Maryland, California. They're all really excited and they're, and they're um, you know, they're loving all these tips and tricks that you guys are sharing for the holidays. But yeah, I love that drama on, on the lip for sure. That looks great. And, and Eileen, so I was going to go a little opposite. I love a good red as well. And I encourage everyone to get your party red. Um, but sometimes you want to dial up maybe just your eyes is kind of the look that I was going for, have more drama on the eyes, a little less on the lips. So I was going with the Clinique Classic um, Black Honey. I don't know if anybody's heard of Black Honey, but it is the number oh. one selling lipstick shade in North America right now. Um, it's not quite a lipstick, not quite a gloss. It's actually more of a balm um, and it, it just glides right on the lips, no fuss. And it gives just this beautiful sheer tint. Uh, what is so fun about it is that it looks good on all skin tones um, and it really is kind of chameleon. It, it changes based off of your natural uh, skin tone on your, on your lips, your lip tone there. So it's a fun, easy lipstick for any day really, but um, especially for those parties where you really want your eyes to be the focus, this is a nice way to have a subtle, um, but yet yeah, a little something there lip. I love it. Well, you know what? We've brought a lot of drama. I feel like we needed to give one gift from you and me to all the viewers, Emily. Oh, Do you yes. want to give, yeah, a drama free gift for everyone. Are you guys ready for it, Emily? Yeah. So I brought out my little jar here. Um, this actually holds 10 days worth of uh, yeah, mine foundation. Too. You've got yours too. Yeah. So 10 days worth of foundation. We want to gift to you all um, from Estee Lauder, from Clinique. Um, go see your uh, advisor, your beauty advisor, your consultant at the exchange, and they will customize the shade for you um, as we both have many different shade ranges. Um, options for you out there. Um, so go see your, uh, your consultant at your local exchange to get your free 10 day supply of foundation from, from both of us. So before we, you know, finish this, I think we got to set the festive mood with a fragrance. I'm holding one of my favorite fragrances of the season. And if you have a fragrance that you love, drop in a chat, how you want your fragrance to make you feel I'm feeling like this season, whether you're naughty or nice, Emily and I have a few great recommendations for you. I love this because Beautiful Magnolia is a fragrance that really, um, if you dare to love, it really embodies kind of that feminine, flirtatious personality. I'm going to spray it. And I love to spray behind the ears. And then they say I should just spray and walk through, All right? Uh, it's kind of romantic. It's um, very uh, radiant but it has these hypnotic notes of lush magnolia. It's making my mouth water now. Um, solar gardenia, warm woods, and this luminous musk. It's a good one. I'm telling you, you won't go wrong. How about you, Emily? What are you setting the mood with? 
All right, so I can't not set the mood without talking about Happy, right? Clinique Happy. Um, it actually launched in 1997 uh, and still, you know, one of one of the top selling fragrances in the industry. What is really cool about this is you talked about mood. Uh, when you spray this, 97% of people say when they wear this, they feel happier. So, you know, I think in the world that we live in today, we can all use happy, have more happiness. We can all give the gift of happiness to um, friends and family. It's a fun way to, uh, to add that little extra layer of happiness um, to the world. So it's a hint of citrus. Uh, we use ruby red grapefruit um, for that citrus moment. Um, and then a wealth of flowers. We have the Hawaiian uh, wedding flower and then mimosa um, in the formula as well to layer that again, hint of citrus and wealth of flowers. So spread some happiness this holiday season uh, and drop a little happy in everyone's stocking uh, if you want to, you know, lighten that mood a little and um, spread that joy. So uh, we want to thank you guys so much for, you know, tuning in and listening to Eileen and I today. We hope that we've been able to give you some ideas for gifts for others, but also remember gift yourself as well as there's so much, um, so much uh, value, I think, in what we've talked about today uh, for makeup as well as skincare and fragrance. So Dora, I'll turn it back to you. Thank yeah, you. thank you guys. I mean, I think between Emily and Eileen, you've got us covered. Estee, Estee Lauder and Clinique has us covered with skincare, complexion, makeup, and fragrance. I think we're ready for the holidays. Um, and of course, to our viewers, you know, our links um, to all, uh, all of these products on Shop My Exchange dot com are in the comments also in our event link um, and if you're able to go in the store surprise I had no idea we were getting a sample for a foundation so that's great you know hit up your beauty counter and take advantage of that but thank you so much ladies now we are definitely ready for the holidays one for me one, two for me, one for you. <laughs> it's so exciting. I love it. I, it's, it's a great way to kick off the holiday. So we we are so grateful to thank you, um, to have you here today. So thank you so much. Appreciate it. And thanks That's everybody holidays. for joining us today. Um, and be on the lookout for our next post uh, for our next Beauty Live, because of course we love to bring you uh, the best in beauty. Um, thank you so much, Beauty Tribe. Have a great weekend. Thanks, Emily. That's thanks, Emily. Bye. Thank you, Dora. Bye, everyone. Bye.